Hello everybody, welcome to this edition of Mr. Jay's Geek Corner. A place where we talk about anything and everything that is geek, whether it be TV, comics, movies, and video games. And this week's subject is kind of a little bit of a weird subject. I know that I, it, y'all know what I'm talking about when I talk about when I, when I, y'all, y'all, y'all know what I'm talking about. Um, that is um, all these videos, the phenomenon of all these videos on all these Let's play videos that have popped up across YouTube. And for those of y'all that don't really know what that is, um, it's folks essentially making videos of themselves playing video games. I mean, I love playing video games. And I've even been on, me and my wife even been on the. Uh, videotape ourselves playing video games but usually we're just laughing carrying on and stuff but there are folks that sit there and just make like um, they just they just play the games and they like weird and they like sarcastic and vulgar remarks while they're playing a game and just um, all kind of, and most of them ain't even suitable for young ears let's just say that I mean they're just sitting there making vulgar remar- vulgar and profanity laced remarks while they're playing a the game and just hollering, just ranting. It's just all it is, is just in playing video game. And then some of them is like supposed to be meant for like. I, I understand. I ain't bashing all the ones that's like. I ain't here speaking down, speaking against all these video, all the videos online to playing video games. Some of them are meant to be like tutorials to show you, to and almost like hints to show you how to play the game or show you what the game looks like or something like that. That's one thing, but. Is people doing commentary while they're doing it? I mean, if it's one thing telling, trying to give you hint, here's a hint here, here's what you do here to get this, here's what you get. That's one thing. It's one thing if it's like an instructional tutorial of how to play the game and give you helpful t- uh, helpful tips and hints along the way to enhance your game experience. That's one thing. Or basically just playing it straight through and recording it like it's a movie or something. That's one thing. But it's I'm talking about these Let's Play ones where they're just sitting there doing commentary, just yammering on, um, yammering on, using foul language all throughout the thing, and half the time it's just it's just annoying. And the reason I bring this up is I followed in the past subject of um. The show Foamy the Squirrel, um, about and the, and the whole thing about the difference between geeks and nerds. Well, he's kind of um, inspired this episode too, in that um, the creator of the show. They said uh, um, he said his reason for do, uh, uh, he talked about he's racked up a lot of video games over the years, over the last ten years that he hasn't really done because his show is like a um, twenty-four hour day um, job. Is making it is just making the foamy the squirrel cartoon. So what does he decide to do to feel to not feel guilty for slacking off? And he said he wanted more time to play video games. So what does he do in his wisdom to um to have his essentially I'm gonna say have his cake and eat it too, not feel guilty for slacking off. Slacking off by playing slacking off from the show by playing video games. What does he do? And his infinite wisdom, he essentially, I said he, I said, like I said, he has to have his cake and eat it too approach. By by what you ask? Making a let's play video starring Foamy the Squirrel. It's essentially him playing through, um, maybe a level, maybe two of the of a new Lara Croft game that's come out. Re- I guess come out recently. Him playing um, a Tomb Raider game and having Foamy, his character Foamy, do um, commentary while he's doing it. And uh, that's essentially what it is. It's a Foamy the Squirrel Let's Play Tomb Raider game. Let's Play Tomb Raider video. And I went over there to the comments. I don't know how many. I a good ninety ninety nine percent of them were nothing but um a good ninety nine percent want nothing but negative reviews saying it's tough. So I said not like 
comments like, not you too, not you too, and, and, and not you too, why'd you have to do this, and um, so it's come to this, a let's play video, and stuff like that, and it's just, it's garnered a lot of negative reviews, and one person actually put it, the, put it best, put it best, is if you're feeling uninspired, take a break, but, as if you're feeling uninspired, take a break, and I, uh, which leads me to say, enough of this kind of videos. Somebody actually put it best and said, "We have enough." They said, "We have enough of these, vi enough of this crap clogging up YouTube as it is. Why even you got to add to it?" That was one. That was another comment on it, and I kind of tend to agree. Foamy, I'm gonna say, though an adult show. It is usually pretty funny. Those a lot of it's kind of gross. I'm gonna say, don't let your kids see it. Don't let your kids see it. It's not a kid show, and if you're squeamish and don't like that kind of stuff, don't watch it either. Don't watch it. But um, uh, and see if you're and see if you're squeamish and kind of sensitive that kind of um, pardon, um, that kind of subject matter, adult subject matter, don't watch the show. But usually it's pretty funny. A lot of rants that he does and everything, but. This is the first one that I've seen that is, I was like, why did he even do that? Because he is essentially adding to so many other channels, even IGN, which is mostly like a, I guess to say, like a pop culture, video game, superhero, geek kind of news channel. Y'all, y'all, I said, y'all, y'all, there's probably a lot of y'all that, um, that keep track of that, that watch them too. You know, they're really informative. But every now and again, maybe every two weeks or so, or maybe every week, they do a let's play video. Like this past week, I saw. I think it was just just um, uh, yeah, just a short time ago. They actually had a let's play with the Walking De with the Walking Dead game with a cast member from the Walking Dead. Seriously? I mean, there ain't no sense in have. I mean, like I said, as I said before, there's nothing wrong with making a tutorial and telling folks how to play the game or giving folks um, helpful hints and tips on how to beat this or get that or get this thing or get that thing or just maybe showing it through like a movie to kind of give you the feel of what the game looks like. That's one thing. That's more, to me, like an instructional video than a Let's Play. That's more of almost like an instructional video of how to play the game. But to have a game, to have it where somebody's essentially there playing a video game, it's essentially playing a video game, and all they're doing is a bunch of smart aleck commentary of everything they come across, there's no need for that on there. It's just a waste of airtime. It's just a waste of airtime for anybody to be doing game to be doing videos like this. Person, if you want to do a gaming video, do like one like I just said. Actually, help people beat the game instead of sitting there playing through the game and making smart eye comments. And on and on the subject of that foamy video, um. Uh, of, the, of that foamy let's play video um the he actually the ironic thing about all this is that not too long ago he actually did a video devoted to bashing actually devoted to bashing and making fun uh, and actually bashing and making fun of, of um let's play videos where he actually went on a kind of a rant of against let's play videos and here he is doing one. That is completely against the character of Foamy the Squirrel, which is essentially a smart aleck, know-it-all, know-it-all, sarcastic squirrel that rants and rails against everything, and yet at the same time tries to enlighten people at the same time. But here he is contradicting himself. I mean, you have him doing a video that is essentially... Essentially railing against um, 
let's play videos where they just essentially play, make make sarcastic remarks and play video games, and yet you do one. What is with that? I mean, you can't have your cake and eat it too. I mean, you can't do a let uh, do a video against let's play videos and then do a let's play video. I mean, what is that? I would get into more. Uh, so I would get into more of it, but uh, I wouldn't get. I mean, it's just, it's just, it's, it, it makes your head hurt. I said, but bottom line, bottom line, enough of the let's play videos. We don't need to see you playing the game and making your little sarcastic remarks about it. Nobody wants to sit there and watch that. There's a lot there. There's way too much of that stuff out there to be adding to it. I mean, that's one thing you will not. I'm gonna say for certain, you will not see on this show is a let, Mr. J's Geek Corner Let's Play show. You will not see it. If I do, that's when I know it's time to hang it up. If I ever resort, even resort, thinking of resorting to a uh, to a Let's Play show, I'm hanging it up. I mean that. If I even resort to posting any, any uh videos where I'm just playing through one certain video game and making sarcastic remarks I'm hanging it up I'm going to just I'm not I'm not going to do the show anymore either there take a break and try to and try to find some more ideas and I said but that's just my say on it what do y'all think um, am I out of line the do y'all do, do y'all there anybody out there that likes let's play videos um, or do y'all agree with me y'all do y'all think there, there are no, there are too many out there and enough is enough um, let me know as always drop me a comment in the comment box comment box, comment box. I would love to hear what y'all had to say and I guess that's all for this week's edition of Mr. J's Geek Corner as always if you have a comment any comment about the show drop me a comment in the comment box um, like subscribe um if y'all have any um i said if y'all have any fresh ideas you think uh, any ideas for things you want to hear me talk about on the show um drop me a comment comment box i'm always looking for fresh new fun things to talk about on this show and do show and uh, talk about and on here and do shows about and i said i'm always looking for new ideas i, I would love to hear your ideas and i said that's it. Like I said, send me idea. I would love to hear from you. I really would love to hear from you. I really would love to hear all your all your ideas. And I'll see y'all next time.